Hey Dax, uh, had a pretty good practice today. I'm um, just wondering how you feeling after today, uh, because you know a lot of guys tend to you know get their hopes up, or you know they tend to catch a, get a big ego after one good practice, you know. And um, you had a good practice. I just want to know how you're going to respond after this practice. Will this be something that we see consistently? I'm going to do my best going forward. I'm going to put one step in front of the other and uh, just look ahead. So yeah. Yeah. Man, hats off to you today, man. It was Thank excellent you. work. Uh, well. I was proud of you, man. And uh, well. keep keep climbing, man. I see the progression about, every day. I have a question for him, too. Yes. How was your practice? How, how have you been doing this OTAs? Everything been good? Um, you know, how's being an Alabama product and bringing that to the Cincinnati Bank? Yeah. Uh, it's been fun. Uh, ever since I stepped on this campus, uh, I say campus because you know I come from I come from college and, and it's kind of stuck on my mind. But uh, ever since I stepped on these grounds, nothing but fun, uh, nothing but excitement, nothing but great teammates, great energy, great atmosphere, and um, I just continue to get better every day. You know, OTA that's what it's about. It's about getting better, learning your new teammates, uh, learning the rookies. Learning your, your new free agent, your new signees, uh, seeing guys like Vaughn come back, be able to help guys like me, help guys like Gina, help guys like Tyson. You know, it's, it's been fun, a good journey, and I'm excited Tyson, for the season. Uh, I'm just chilling. I don't really know what's going on over here, but I look like a. Oh, yeah, yeah. What's yeah. Up? Um, you know, I, I've seen you grow, uh, and man, like the energy you bring to this locker room, like it's like every time you walk in, guys are smiling. Uh, it's, it's just it's just all it's all fun, yeah, all fun and giggles. And uh, I just want to know, like, where does that come from? Like, is that from you, your parents? I'd probably say just being happy, man. Yeah. Just when you put things in perspective. Even though I'm hurt, even though I'm not playing with y'all, yeah. I'm still blessed to to, to be around y'all. Be around good guys like you, yeah. great guys like him. Oh my God, yeah. I'm I'm just blessed. So it's happy to be around y'all. Yes, I appreciate that. Guys, I love you. Guy right I love you. Man. Both of these guys are very stand up. Just trying to be innovation. Like All right, you can continue your interview with Dax. <laughs> He's got nothing. You, you ready? Today. You ready? How's the corner position going for you? Great. You got my work for me. You're gonna take my job. Can't do it. You can take can't it. Go ahead. Here, you can take it. I can't do Please that. Please do it. I can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dax. So for real, how has the transition been, and how has playing safety helped you in your transition to cornerback? Uh, it's been been great so far. It's uh, obviously a transition um, that I've I've been you know stacking every day, um, trying to learn something new every day and uh, critique myself. Um, whether it's good or bad, and uh, uh, really, I feel like my transition from safety to corners really kind of helped me in terms of uh, just knowing certain calls. Say if a moving piece on offense uh, happens, knowing a certain call or check to get into. Um, obviously, I rely on my safety now just to, you know, re relay the call to me. But I kind of um, already know what the check is going to be. But also, just having that um, that clarification with my safety, I feel like kind of reassures what I'm playing. And uh, yeah, kind of just. Knowing the entire defense from, you know, a different perspective, I feel like that only helps me. I've always been told by defensive coordinators that if a guy knows the position and what the um, the job is of every position on his side, he is going to be more confident going in. Is that kind of the feeling that you've got right now? Um, I'm gaining my confidence. I wouldn't say I have all the confidence in the world, but um, uh, I'd say that definitely helps out. Um, definitely helps with, you know, uh, my toolbox, knowing uh, certain calls and, you know, playing fast. So that's what it's all about, playing fast and uh, doing your responsibility. We've all seen throughout the last couple of years that speed is your God-given talent, a gift. Um, are you? Do you get anxious to be able to showcase your gift on the field and go full speed and, like, live reps? Uh, no, I mean, I feel like this is what I've been made to do. Uh, you know, flying around, I mean, that's what we're all here for. I mean, flying around, having fun, and uh, making plays. I feel like that's what I want to do at this new position and, uh, you know, you know, just have fun. Last question for you. What has been the biggest challenge for you making that switch? Uh, really, I think... Uh, I think really just the mental part of it, um, getting over plays. I mean, you're not going to really stop every play, so having a short-term memory and uh, really just putting it behind me and just moving to the next next uh, play, I feel like that's the biggest part of being a corner. Uh, you're going against some of the best athletes in the world out there, and uh, I feel like, uh, you know, right now, OTAs, I feel like that's going to prepare me, and uh, training camp right now in the summer, I feel like that's all going to, you know, mesh together well to, you know, help me for the season, so. Do you look forward to matching up against Jamar Chase in training camp? Oh yeah, for sure. I mean, today we was in a we was in the walkthrough, and uh, 
Yeah, I mean, it was in a walkthrough, and, uh, you know, he's kind of just telling me what he was thinking. I was kind of bouncing some things off him a little bit. But, but yeah, I feel like he's going to, you know, help me out a lot out there and uh, really just going to be competitive, I feel like, for sure, in training camp. It sounds like today was more a collaboration between you two versus shit talking. Yeah, oh, yeah, a little bit, a little bit. You know, I'm I'm more locked in, but once I you know I lo- loosen up a little bit, I feel like I I say a little bit of stuff, um, stuff. But hey, I'm just staying composed right now. You know, I haven't really arrived yet. So so yeah.